Hey YouTubers, this is Healing A6, AK Raymond. As you can tell by the title, that is right. We've got an exclusive on Twitter that Ben Affleck will not direct the film The Batman. Now, I, I can tell why he didn't want, doesn't want to direct this, even though he felt confident that he was going to do it, but as a director, guys, he said that, he, he actually said in his words that being a director and playing a character is really hard work. And it really is. I mean, you guys seen uh, that movie Argo, and as you can tell that, uh, that Ben Affleck wasn't nominated for that, but he was the one who directed the film and also starred in the film as the lead. So, I can tell it's really hard to do all that, but I can tell you one person that can actually do a good job directing the film and starring in it, and that's Clint Eastwood. As you guys know, Clint Eastwood is a legend when it comes to directing the film and also starring in it. When he actually got an Oscar for Unforgiven, a Western movie where he played the hero and stopping a gang by himself with, alongside Morgan Freeman, of course. Now, also, he actually won, um, well, actually, he didn't win an Oscar for Best Director. Actually, he did, actually. He won a, direct, he won a directing uh, Oscar for Million Dollar Baby, which he starred and directed, which is pretty good. And that shows right there that he is a very talented uh, director knowing that he was able to get the job done and everything. But as for Ben Affleck, let's get back to there. <laughs> ben Affleck, he's a good actor. For him to play the Batman, Batman, like three times, it's pretty good. Who knows, he might beat the record on Christian Bale's. Because Christian Bale played him three times. And we'll see, and I think he will continue to play Batman. Now, the reason why Christian Bale didn't play Batman for Batman vs. Superman is because, in, in his words, they didn't ask him. <laughs> so, but for this director, Zack Snyder, who directed uh, Batman vs. Superman, he wanted an older looking uh, Batman. And Ben Affleck uh, fit the part. He actually got, did an interview with him and actually did like an audition and he did a hell of a job. So, that shows right there, he was dedicated to play the Dark Knight, one of DC's greatest superheroes. So, Despite all that, guys, <coughs> I, I'm sure that whoever's going to direct this film, the, the Batman, I, let's hope he'll do a good job. I'm sure Ben Affleck would have done a great job directing this film. And although we are, we are, there is a rumor that we might see uh, Death Deathstroke as the villain in the in this Batman film. So, so he did, he was he would rather play the Batman instead of directing it and starring in it. So he's better to star than doing both at the same time. But hey, there's a lot of people who can do that. I guess uh, Ben Affleck wasn't ready to do that. But hey, some directors can't be able to do all of it. But like I said before, Clint Eastwood is the number one person who can direct the film and star it at the same time. I'm sure you guys agree with me on that. So. Guys, give me your comments on how do you feel that Ben Affleck is not directing the standalone Batman film. I'm sure you guys are saying, I say, you, uh, I agree with you, I don't disagree with you, I'm sure he could have done it. But hey, guys, like I said before, it takes a lot of work to direct a film and also be the one to act the star in the film. But I think Ben Affleck made a good choice. But the question is, who is going to direct this film? It could be anybody, I'm not sure. But if I had to guess, I would be surprised if, if Zack Snyder, who is the one who directed the dark, uh, who directed Men of Steel and also Batman vs Superman, I'm sure he'll get the job done. I'm sure of it. Well guys, I hope you guys enjoyed this. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel for more reaction, more gameplay. Drop a like on this video if you enjoyed this. I'm almost out of here. I got a half hour to go, but I'm, I'll be glad to be home. All right, you guys, thank you for watching and don't forget, Stay positive.